مجددا في منبر مبادره الباحثين السودانيين اليوم الخميس 18 رمضان الموافق 23 مايو 2019 مبادره الباحثين السودانيين اخواننا حريه سلام وعداله والوعي خيار الشعب نرحب باساتذه اللغه الانجليزيه المتطوعين والليله ان شاء الله متابعين هم بالتزام في برنامج مخاطبة نادي مخاطبة اللغة الإنجليزية في منبر مبادرة الباحثين السودانيين رحب بهم شكرا جزيلا لهم شكرا لكم شكرا لكم شكرا لكم السلام عليكم شكرا لكم 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 So we're going to talk, because we've talked before about uh, change, freedom. So we're going to talk today about justice. justice. Yeah. So we're going to know what the meaning of justice. Okay. The meaning of justice, the concepts of justice, and the transitional justice. So those are the points of today. And thank you. Okay, thank you very much indeed. Good evening, everybody. Really, it is um, great things to be in front of you. And as my brother mentioned that today, as we know, we're talking about uh, justice. And uh, what I would like to tell you something, by the way, um, you know, I mean that figure out or pull out what so-called the bad negative idea in your nervous systems, for example, pull out your idea which you can create your mind that you are not qualified enough so as to speak about English. So everybody here can speak English even a little bit. The matter is to come out, or out here for the stage and just move out a little bit of words, even one word. Justice means justice and get back to your seat. It doesn't matter because tomorrow you will be better. So there's an article that speakers in all over the world, what so-called um, um, Les Brown says, uh, failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm ultimately will be good. So today you talk a little bit and tomorrow and after tomorrow will be good speakers. So our topic today about justice, what justice it means to you, what the fundamental principle of justice, what the fundamental principle of justice, what the concepts of justice, and how the transmissions of justice it will be. So the topic, maybe it isn't easy for everybody to discuss about it. And hello, welcome. The door is open for everybody. And the question is, is open mind questions. It doesn't mean to restrict it for the certain questions. Whatever you have in your mind, pull out. It doesn't matter. And hello, welcome. The door is open for everybody. Yeah, welcome. Your name? Anas Awabakar. Gives him a heart club. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. My name is Anas Awabakar Mahmoud Adam. Today we are going to talk about justice and what justice means to me. Justice means to me is to take your rights back, but according to the court of the law. For example, if you stole some jewel from me, from justice to get it back, right? This is from justice. And while we are talking about justice, I have to mention something that is very important. The Dufourian and the New Mountain and the Blue Nile people, they are the most much people need justice these days from the coming government to fix the damages that the former government has made from warring, rape, raping, and killing, and immigrating. To feel themselves feel a peace, a peace, peace, all right. Uh, be, uh, not be, uh, be a peace. Uh, as they are mixing about differing, uh, about justice and equality, I have to mention it. The difference between justice and equality. The justice mean to give everyone, every one of people something from the same kind. But in uh, equality, this doesn't matter. For example, from justice, if you have three piece of candies and you have three kids, if you want to give them justice, you have to give 
to give each one of them one piece of candy. But from equality, for example, this is a matter from example, if you have three kids, two, <laughs> sorry, I'm talking great, great. Uh, if you have three kids and they wanted to watch a match behind the wall, can you imagine the picture? Three kids, a wall behind the wall, a match of football, maybe. And they are not in the same lengths. The first one, at the tall enough, to he can peep behind the wall. He can see the, he can watch a football match already. And the second, at the middle, maybe he can see, but not well. Maybe he's doing like this, a semi watch. And the third, it's short. He can't see. If you want to give them a justice, and you have three barrels, barrels. If you want to give them a justice to give each one of them one barrel. But if you want to apply the equality, you have to give the youngest one of them two barrels. I mean, to double it, to make him see. And the second, you have to give him one barrel. But the third, he doesn't need a barrel to watch. This is my view about this. Is uh, thank you very much indeed. Uh, the door is still open for everybody. Who is going to be next speaker? Yeah, welcome. Give him a hard clap. Thank you. Okay, let me introduce myself. My name is Musa Hassan. Uh, okay, in the name of Allah, the gracious, the merciful ladies and the gentlemen, hello everybody. Oh. Beautiful audience, it's a great opportunity to stand in front of us. At the moment, I want to talk about a topic very important in our life. But in the first, thank you our uh, Sudanese Research Foundation for giving us this opportunity uh, to make, uh, make ourselves uh, to have a confidence. And uh, thank you our teacher for giving us uh, the chance uh, to practice English. And uh, also thank you all of you for attending uh, to get the knowledge. Uh, in, in my little view, uh, about uh, justice. Justice is, uh, uh, justice is uh, a compliance, a com a com uh, justice is a compliance between people. If you, if, you give this, if you give this man, you must give the same what you give this man for that man. That is what I am trying to say about uh, justice. And what meaning that when, uh, when, uh, when, uh, when they, this, uh, when this when this uh, this man and uh, do crimes, we must uh, banish banishment uh, both of them and they did not uh, uh, banish it. banishment uh, both of them and they did not uh, uh, Korea cor uh, and they did not uh, compare compare one on another. That is what I am trying to say. And uh, all of you, you know, in our society. Uh, when the police uh, is arrested on uh, the the son of a government official in uh, in uh, a dark in a dark uh, crime, he didn't uh, he didn't uh, do for him anything, and he let him go. That is why, my friend. And uh, why he don't uh, banish banish him? If uh, if he he, he afraid if he banish him, he will uh, lost her his uh, his uh, job. So that he, uh, he don't uh, do anything for him. Uh, in my opinion, that is a bad habit. And uh, I wish in uh, our new Sudan to, uh, to hate this habit and uh, Allah is the law. Nobody offers the law. And uh, what, and uh, Allah, thank you for listening. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, just uh, let me ask you a question. Uh, if we have here two little kids, okay? so. Both of them are hungry. Some of uh, the first one likes vegetables, and the second likes meat. And you have only meat to to feed them. Is it considered to be? Uh, is it considered uh, like justice? No. So what is it? So here I I gave both of them meat. Is it justice? No, you must uh, get a uh, fuchatable for another one. Yeah. And, uh, 
and uh, his main uh, components, components for him, for this uh, kid. Yeah. Thank you so much. So, if I give them, both of them, me, here, yeah, I'm not doing justice, right? Yeah, I'm doing equality. So, equality does not mean justice, right? They are different. So, I should give every one of them the thing that he likes or she likes, right? So, this is justice. It means fairness. The chance is still here. Yeah, welcome. What's your name? Thank you. My name is Hamid. Hamid, please give Mr. Hamid a harsh lap. The question is, I don't know. Uh, we are talking about justice. We are talking about justice. So what is justice? All right. The justice is a kind of equality between the people. Might be two or more. To make the justice between the people is mean you're using the law of God. It mean you're fixing the law of God. So the justice might be coming from heaven. So it's the order of God. So everyone must have it. When you are um, the leader of country and you're missing the, the justice, it means you are really the your injustice. So the justice, it is the most fundamental things that can fix the nation and to give agreement between the people and even the fix in the country. Constitution is a kind also of the justice. So the justice, it is the tall because it's the message that comes from God. So everyone must commit to do it right. So how could you feel when you are Oppressing the people, it means you are breaking the law of God. So it means you are illegal. So that's why um, we are uh, existing here also to find the justice. We do all facing here to find the justice and to know the word justice because it is the one that directly related with the religion. So, um, I don't want to follow. So. Okay, I'm going to help you obey. I'm going to help you obey some questions. For the next soon period, I mean the transitional period, so how can we do justice for the ex regime and how can we do justice for the uh, Maltese families? So, some families uh, <laughs> lost their kids or uh, their sons, right? So, how can we do justice for them and for the ex regime? All right. To bring the justice, first of all, you must own the government that you're signing for. This means the civil government. Through the civil government, you should be able to investigate the, for those who committed the crime against the people. So this is the kind, or might be the beginning of the justice. And after that, we have an independent law that can accept the people who have the cases, so they might open the cases. So very clearly and very blankly for everyone. And after that, we will see who is being oppressed by so much. We will begin from individual to community. The individual into community, the individual, it is the most important because there are uh, some oppression that might happen between the two people. So that's why I say we must begin uh, from the individual and then the community. When we talk about the community, this is what we hear. This is the community, and every one of us here has the a special demand or request that you want to investigate it, but through justice. So that's why, for those who are being uh, oppressive, yes, as I said before, we will collect or to take her right or her right through the justice and uh, that's all uh, thank you thank you so much <laughs> okay thank you for what he has said so as you know uh justice it is 
to give each person each person what he or she deserve fairly that means everyone to have an equal rights at the same liberty for all rights so the, the fundamental principle of justice is to legalize treatment between people to distribute everything legally so my questions is open for everybody so do the justice is um, for example i mean um, the justice is like uh, god given as a well or justice is a system required from some law or a justice is inherent from nature itself overall justice required or justice regarded as so important for human beings so we need that we need answering for such questions and the door is open for everybody hello welcomes who is going to be the next speaker please please take your chance welcome what's your name um nekromo welcome you can have a club okay. um, hello everybody uh, good evening uh, thank you for this uh, great opportunity and i do thank also uh, sudanese uh, research foundation for this chance uh, actually you know um, the topic is actually interesting topics uh justice uh you see uh, as you see you know uh, let me uh, talk about uh, justice itself all right Uh, actually uh, in 19 or right, uh, 95 uh, as we are uh, Sudanese uh, we are suffering from this uh, uh, former regimes right uh, Amina al Bashir regimes right uh, they killed uh, uh, Sudanese peoples all right uh, so you know um, we are just you know uh, struggling for our rights freedoms So why we get to start our school so why we are all here in this uh, in this uh, uh, place right because as you see we have been dominating all right with these regimes they killed our peoples no mountains Darfur and Blue Niles even in the uh, north side even in or in, uh, in the middles actually I've been suffering from this government so uh, I do encourage you we we, we try to uh, to you know Al Bashir must be to ICC so we hope so right one day you know we will uh, you see yeah, yeah. yeah. we're going to try um, you you want Bashir to be trialed right what about trialing him here in Sudan you have a court here and a a public trial in front of the eyes of people Which one uh, is going to be better? To trial him here in Sudan or in the ICC? Uh ICC, all right? Because ICC, all right, because you know, as you know, this uh, regimes all right, they killed Sudanese peoples and you know, there is genocide in Darfur and Lumo Mountains and Blue Niles, even north side in the middles. And we have been suffering from this government um Uh, even more than uh, 30 uh, 30 years you see and uh, we hope right we just you know focusing for uh, a civil government when uh, when we bring the civil government we must to uh, equalize those whom they you know commit the crimes must be all right uh, yeah thank you so much he supports the idea of trialing him in the icc so Al Bashir to ICC 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 That's it yes. Okay so he must go there So again we are talking about justice so what does justice mean and the concepts of justice and for the coming period what do you see justice Yeah welcome Uh is you're after him okay. What's the name? What's your name? 
My name is Mahdi Muhammad Ali. Please give Mr. Mahdi a harsh clap. Thank you a lot uh, for every single one of you. Thank for your coming and you you look like people who really want to learn because uh, when people s uh, sit here and they are speaking I see you are listening to them intentively thank you a lot and good evening Thanks. okay I'm going to define justice according to my own humble perspective justice means telling those people the military transitional uh, council telling them that you must stop dancing around the truth and take the NCB members to the real justice that we are talking about and let them face the law as a result for what they have done over 30 years. They did use Quran as a marketing book as well as religion as justification of killing and raping women in West Sudan. We've been suffering from this regime for a long time. It's it, Really it's about manipulation. They are, all of them are manipulators. They, they keep saying lots of things which are not true totally lies so the second point which is about justice the money they took outside sudan the great investment they they made outside of sudan we must bring back the money to the treasury of people it's my money and it's yours the money that's supposed to participate productively in the development of sudan thank you a lot thank you so much thank you and i uh, like your definition for justice thank you because this is a live definition thank you Thank you. This is his own philosophy, and it's very good definition, by the way. So over there, my brother, Mr. Abdelaziz, welcome. Uh, thank you. Give him a hard clap. Uh, uh, thank you very much for granting me this opportunity. And uh, for me, talking about justice in the upcoming transitional period is one of the fundamental issues. The essential question is that why Sudanese people are demanding those suspects of international crimes to be handed over to the International Criminal Court, ICC. Um, this is a very important and a fundamental question which is facing us as Sudanese people, and the particularly the revolutionists, and those people who are demanding for the change, for lasting change in Sudan. Why? Because those people have committed a very gross crimes, violations against international law, committed war crimes, crimes. Sudanese people are part of international criminal. Inter ICC is a one of the international mechanism, is a one of the very fundamental international institutions. The question is that whether we have a system to try those people in our own country or we have important judiciary systems, then the question is are we ready to have this? I think this is a very logic, a very reasonable question that we should have to as the nationalist in the coming period. Uh, his people, it is very close to by their own admissions, confessions. Bashir himself that when the international uh, community and international organized organization but accuse him by killing those people no i didn't kill 300 but i killed only 10 thousands this is a law this is a law we consider as a fully you know, admissions and confessions he committed. He killed about 10, not only 10, he said, only 10,000 Sudanese people. So this is, this is, are not 
and other sorry um, i don't want to be very chatter box but i want to discuss this with my friend <laughs> i like it because this is uh, my own uh, specialization as i am a lawyer uh, i try to specify so this this is as i said constitutes crimes based on international law secondly also they have committed crimes based of international humanitarian law this is two parts of international law so for that reason i see some people may get angry from my own speech but i want i see for me if we met hybrid you know uh, judicial mechanism or sudanese you know judicial mechanism to try it i say very competent sudanese mechanism to try those people is better than the international mechanism you know why because in international mechanism they have a very fantastic judicial system so the suspects or accused people they have fully rights say go court and come from court international lawyers this is good beginning bleeding this is a good but if we have and even in international law they don't have a capital capital punishment you know capital punishment you know they don't have a capital punishment so for me as one of the victims one of the victims of the human rights violations in Darfur. For me, someone who lost his dear brother, his dear friend, his dear uncle, his dear, he want to see that justice to be applied. He want to see those, those people to be, you know, punished by the, you know, capital punishment. I don't want to, those people to be lead to the, you know, life imprisonment. No. Me, for, for me, and that's why I see those people who made their own legal law, uh, legal you know systems i you know we have a criminal law it's very nice you know they themselves made a criminal law in criminal law even they punish who those commit you know political crimes why we don't try those people who killed a million people in darfur blue nine you know and uh, nuba mountains with but you know with the laws that they made by their own hands so we have to try them we have sent them to, to the hell in sudan here we have sent them to the hell in sudan here not to go there to the heck international criminal court to 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 enjoy with some rights i don't like that my friend i mean here one or i want to be one of the lawyers who stands to you know advocate who stands to you know in front of sudanese you know legal mechanism in front of sudanese you know judicial system this is a very fundamental issue and the second thing that we want the victims of this human right gross human right violation to see the justice by their own you know by their own eyes if the trial takes place in for example in heck they will not be able to follow up the procedures of the trial so my friend this is the concept and the philosophy of justice for me and there may be some people they we you know share with me the same idea or others will not share but i this is what i believe so for us and for sudanese people and all the victims of these gross violation they should have to see the justice to be applied and no uh, making any reconciliations with the, you know with these very bad you know history with these very bad past unless we see those people who committed these crimes to be tried justifiably and and then we will feel you know uh, good and then it will be a good introduction to uh, make a social peace you know to build a social peace this is very good you know if those people they do not face justice it is so difficult to make a social peace among sudanese people thank you my friend for this opportunity thank you so much
Thank you so much. Well, low speaks, you should be listening. Yes. Okay, that's it. Thank you so much. Uh, we're talking about justice again. So, what is justice? And yeah, what do you see the justice in the transitional period? I think Mr. Sammy over there is having something to say. Welcome, Mr. Sam. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. So, justice, uh, in my perspective, is like to have all of us our equal rights, uh, no one above the law. All of us, we have to be judged by the same law that which is like uh, which are suitable to us. Uh, and there is like injustice law that uh, like harming a lot of people here, like uh, uh, the laws of like the they uh, like uh, arrest the tea makers or the like previous workers so it's just, like injustice laws that works against the nations so uh, as like uh, uh, also like the, the people who are like homeless and they will have nothing to do in their lives so they live in the crowd in like in the bad bad world and no one focus to them and no one like give them their rights so this must be like applied to to enhance their life to change them so and also we got like a young our brothers that's whom are like every day they send them to the war in which is war that uh, does not belong to us which is like in Yemen and other places in uh, uh, Middle East so those young brothers they must be back to Sudan and to have their right in education or to to feed our country so now we like we need them because our country is like uh, now we're starting the to to rise our country from the bottom to the top so we need to have like justice in everywhere so this is it thank you so much mr sam i've got a question for you uh, does we need, uh, do we need just a, a means a different kind of justice, for example, different kind of law, sorry. Uh, for example, law for people, okay, and law for leaders and laws for the president. Do we need so? So, like, all what we need is, like, all of us, we have to be governed by the same law. Presidents, prime minister, or, like, uh, whatever. So, all of us, we have to be the same. So... If you did, uh, if you did, uh, or, or you commit the crimes, you have to send to the jail, as you, as the president, as anywhere. So no one above the law. So all of us, we have to be equal in the eyes of the law. So this is what we want to. Okay. Thank you so much, Mr. Sam. Thank you. Okay. Thank you a lot. Uh, yeah, the time is open. Uh, welcome. Your name? Uh, yeah, yeah. Give him a heart clap. Um, uh, first, uh, thank you very much indeed uh, for giving me this uh, opportunity. And uh, particularly speaking about uh, justice. Um, according to my, uh, uh, my simple idea, I mean the concept of uh, justice, uh, I think uh, justice is um, um, has come from, I mean, the uh, the Latin word which is uh, just uh, means, um, I mean, fair. The word fair or means low or means like uh, right. So, as we are here in this, uh, I mean, to the military headquarter, and we know that we are revolutionaries and uh, we are trying to get i mean the i mean the the, the right of uh, sudanese people that's being stolen by um these uh, i mean in gas uh, government so i think justice is one of these fundamental i mean the part of i mean the coming period which is i mean the democracy how can we um, you know, establish, I mean, the democracy. So, uh, one of these, I mean, the, 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 the pillars of, of, of democracy is, is to try to fix, I mean, the, the justice, because justice, uh, by justice, we feel that we are Sudanese. By justice, we feel that nobody is above the law. By justice, we, 
Uh, we feel that we are the same, actually. And, you know, I mean, the good of justice is that, I mean, uh, according to, I mean, the declaration of, um, uh, you know, uh, human right, that nobody is above the law. Um, I heard, I mean, the, the person who just, um, you know, was speaking, I mean, be before me, I mean, I mean, there was like a question about, you know, whether we should have like different laws between, you know, I mean, the, the citizens and the government. Now, according to, I mean, the, 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 the subject of, I mean, the, uh, the subject of, of, of justice, um, according to, I mean, the, 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 the declaration of human rights is that nobody is above the law. So that's it. So we are the same among the law. And if, I mean, the, I mean, the uh, prime minister or president has done something or commit crime, then he should, you know, he should be punished according to this law. And, I mean, the, the, the second pillar of, you know, establishing or having, um, you know, the civilian, I, I mean, the, the civil, uh, civilian government is that we need to fix, I mean, to the concrete, uh, I mean, to the, the, the concrete, uh, I mean, the not domination, but I mean, the, the, you know, to have like, uh, uh, I mean, the, 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 the subject that can control or can guarantee, I mean, to, I mean, the, the, the whole people's right, and that we are going to, we ask, I mean, the, the, the citizens to agree that, that this is, yes, I mean, the constitution, yes, it has to have like a concrete constitution. So these are, I think these, I mean, two, I mean, the, the, the fundamental uh, things that, that should be uh, considered in coming period. I mean, the, the justice and, you know, uh, constitution. Thank you. Thank you so much. He spoke about justice and even the transitional justice. Thank you so much. So once again, we're spoken. Uh, we are spoken. Uh, we are speaking right now about justice. Okay. Uh, what is justice? And even what do you see the justice in the next transitional period? If you'd like to speak, show me yourself. Justice. You like justice? Yeah, lady. Do you like this is to be implemented here? Okay, uh, okay gentlemen. Yeah. Okay, come on. Here. Welcome. Hello, everyone. Hello. My name is Atayu Khalid. And in my opinion, I see injustice is a, a big thing. And uh, I don't talk about uh, human rights or something like that. But uh, don't forget. Uh, we have uh, a lot of things we have uh, to do uh, to give to him uh, justice, like animals, like uh, nature, our nature, like uh, a lot of things. There, and um, this is what I want to say. And I think justice must be done. And I'm still here. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I have a question here. Justice is given or taken? Okay, that is the live question. Is justice given or taken? Is justice, yeah, given or taken. So, do you take your justice? Okay. Oh, you wait someone to give you your justice. Which one? Yeah, welcome. What's your name, firstly? Please give Mr. Muhammad a warm clap. Uh, thank you a lot. Uh, I don't know how to speak uh, fluency, but I will try to speak according to my uh, my knowledge that I got. It. Uh, first of all, let me answer the, the question. Uh, the, I mean, the meaning of the uh, justice. Uh, in my own uh, conception, I think uh, justice is a legal uh, legislation that everyone submit to and deal people equally. Um, what was the, the yeah. question? Is it taken or given? Justice. Uh, the, 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 the question is, is it uh, justice taken or given? Uh, I think uh, justice is uh, to take your rights 
but uh, not by the, the force or using your power. According to the constitution, uh, that ca uh, can guarantee that you are uh, the one who uh, have been stolen or have been uh, uh, killed or raped. You can get uh, your right according to the law. That's all. Okay. If someone over here hits you, what are you gonna do? <laughs> I'll slap you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm not going to, to punish you because uh, this is uh, may increase the, 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 the fight between us and can also make an uh, effect to the other people. So I'm going to uh, uh, I'm going to the court and, and ask my, my rights that. Okay, but here we we assume that oh we, we say uh, we, we see that in, in for example slapping is kind of offensive, right? Uh, slapping, okay, kind of fencing. If someone here slaps you, what are you gonna do? <laughs> uh, I'm not talking. Uh, I'm not taking this as a, the, the personal uh, affecting, but uh, if all of us can go into to, to get our rights by our own hands, that's uh, what the meaning of the the, the, the the justice means, or what the benefit of the justice that. Uh, we have been uh, constituted. Yeah. So I, I'm not going to take my own rights by my own hands. Yeah. Okay. So justice is to do the justice for the one who did something bad for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the justice is uh, to do something for the one who has been uh, uh, for the one who has been a uh, harm or for the one who has been uh, killed yeah that's uh, what i think about. okay thank you so much thank you so much okay are there any uh, after we finish you can speak in arabic after we finish okay sorry for that sorry for that okay um are there any questions no no Okay. I, I, I guess a little bit adding for what the questions uh, justice is taken or it is given. So if you if you were ask me the, the justice is given, I would have been said yes. And if you ask me the justice is taken, I would have been said yes. Both of them it will be uh, together because as we are human beings in a life, everything has been given by Almighty God. But the strong people, they may grab it something from us and later on they will take it from them. So both of them, I think, in my own philosophy, it will be right. What is it? So I, I, I speak that, for example, as we are human beings, our God, they, you know, gives us everything. Everything has been given by Almighty God. But the strong people, they are grabbing something from us and later on they will be taken from them. So if you say that it is given by Almighty God, he said yes. If you say taken from a strong people, also I will say yes. And both of them, on my own philosophy, I think it is true. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, gentlemen. Yeah, just uh, because he, he he didn't have his yes. chance. Okay. Yes. After him. Yeah. Welcome. What's your name? Okay. Please give Mr. Abdul Halim a harsh clap. Uh, first of all. By the name of Allah, the most merciful, the most graceful. And second, hello ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I want to talk about the justice. I want to answer your question. The justice given or taken. And in my opinions, I think the justice is taken, not given. Because you have to be strong to get uh, justice or to get your freedom or to be free that's uh, it's a real life but if you are asking about ourselves or about the justice what is the justice or what is the really mean of justice the justice is in my opinion i think it's equality peace it's also justice. The right is also justice. The justice is to be among every uh, social, to get your free, to do everything that you need, or to make your friends, to be inside them as like you are their brothers. 
as you are in some nation and you are really in some nation but there's uh, some difficulties was facing to communicate with others and I see I think that we have to destroy this uh, space to let uh, all of us being as uh, boys they are delivered by one woman and sons a lot of sons okay uh, uh, yes, uh, I have two questions for you you said that you should be strong to get you white so if someone is weak how can he guess uh, get his white you have to take it but not by fighting by life you have to take it by their your uh, opinion norms of freedom by your uh, knowledge you have to take it you have to be uh, educated or if you are uneducated you have to fight for your right you have to learn that you have a long road among you you have to be strong to go on okay, answers. okay. the second question you said that justice is um, equality for you i'm gonna ask you the same question that i asked before so if here we have two little kids both of them are hungry uh, one of them likes vegetables and the second likes meat and you have only meat are you gonna give them both meat <laughs> same question yeah i know it's same question but uh in this situation one of them like meat yeah. and the other uh, vegetables okay and i have just meat yes because you said that uh, justice means for you equality I'm gonna give them the same amount of meat but if if i ask you the cat who doesn't uh, eat meat okay if i give her meat he doesn't eat like it because it, he can't eat it okay because it's meat okay <laughs> that means justice does not mean equality <laughs> Because he, if if we apply equality, I'm gonna give them both meat, right? Yeah. Because you said equality, right? But one of them does not like meat. He doesn't like it. I know that it doesn't like it, but we have to let them share if she add it or not. He cannot. It will. He cannot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, actually. If she cannot add meat, it will be... It's not, it's not just right? Yes. So, how, how would the justice be here? How would the justice be here? How can you solve the problems? The justice will be here to find uh, another thing or vegetables for the cat who doesn't eat meat. Yeah. That's it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Again, chances are here. Justice. Yeah, you wanna. I just wanted to find something. Okay. <laughs> After him. Okay. Sorry. Sorry for this. Um, I mean the question which has been raised. I mean the. I mean, uh, I mean the. Whether justice is being taken, uh, should be taken or given. I think. Uh, justice, justice, it is state justice is make is mechanism that we use to take our right so it is not uh, something that we can take but we, it is something that we can use to gain or to take back our right that's what i'm saying okay here, here i've got a question for you if said that something is taken why if said something is taken right it is a uh, mechanism that we use to take our rights. So, I mean, the, the, I mean, the things that should be taken is right, but how can you get your right? So, there's a way that you should use. So, you have to go to ask, um, to ask that your right has been stolen, and then you can get your right back. Okay. So, you use something to get, I mean, your right. Okay.
you have something to take your right. So that means it is taken. Uh, yes, taken. Given. <laughs> <laughs> that means it is taken. Yeah, so it's not taken. I mean. As I said, Which one is it? justice, I mean, justice is state, I said, it's state. Okay? Uh, it is something that we can imagine. Oh, it is just kind of low that we can use to get our right. So we use something to get something. So it is not, uh, I mean, uh, neither taken uh, nor given. So it is just like you know a car that you use to move from place to place. So, so we use just only to get our right. But so here, okay. But I mean, I mean the judge, I mean judges can take our right from I mean to those who who uh, uh, have taken or those who have taken our right. So judges can take. Okay, I can take my right by myself. But this is not good way. So the good way is that you have to use. I mean, you have to use. I mean, to, I mean, to, um, a logic way, which is meant to go to court or to, to go to ask that you have something that's being stolen. So, um, God, I mean, the, I mean, the judge, I mean, judges can bring back your right. So, by, by using this way, so you are getting back your right. Okay, you are getting back your right. That means the judge is giving you your right. So, it is given. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna uh, reply for this point at the end of the speech. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Welcome. Um. What's your name? Okay. Uh, please give, uh, give a harsh clap for Mr. Abbas Zakari over here. First of all. I do thank all of you for, his, for your grateful sitting. Uh, uh, nice to meet you again today and good night. Good night. Uh, sorry? What day? Yeah. Justice. Okay. Justice. What is justice? Okay. And what do you see justice in the next transitional period? Okay. What do you want in this, uh, the coming period? What do you want? How this is with me. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Uh, first of all, let us just only make definitions or definition about the justice. As you know, when we say that uh, definitions, so you can imagine in our mind that uh, there is many, uh, there is many way or there is many methods that we can uh, able to to. to Definite or definitions the things to define the thing the the, 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 the the things you see so you talk about the justice uh, uh, justice it has as I said it has many definitions uh, when we when we can say that word just uh, justice so we mean that uh, uh, you are going to you are going to 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 justificate the things. So, uh, in order to get the things uh, by right way, uh, this is according of my uh, concept uh, of the justice. As I said, also there is many methods of uh, definitions. So, uh, it considers that according of the, 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 the issues that they are going to, to get it. So, when you talk about justice, so there is many methods. As I said, so there is a justice of law. And there is a justice of uh, uh, of rights, and there is a justice of uh, uh, different uh, uh, issues. According of the 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 the, the barit, according of the barit that you use the justice, uh, according of the barit that you use justice. Uh, this is uh, the, the meaning of justice. Uh, uh, any person has got different uh, concepts. Uh, can able that to use. Justice in in, in, a, in a place that which he used it. Uh, okay, uh, according of these issues that uh, how justice can uh, can get uh, uh, according of the the body that which he uh, use it uh, right now uh, uh, in in the law. So there is many methods, as I said. Uh, it considered that uh, 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 it considered that of the of the law that which. He, uh, people that are going to use it, it's 
uh, uh, the, 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 the issues exactly, it's considered that a, a large meaning of justice, uh, whatever person uh, that can able to use the things uh, in, in the right place, so uh, this is, we can uh, call it that uh, justice. When you tell a person about a, a, a limited ideas or a, a large ideas, so uh, and you can let the person that can use uh, 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 justice uh, according of his ideas uh, 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 depends that uh, the, his ideas that can be right or wrong. Uh, so you, you can go to use or you are progressing to use justice uh, uh, within uh, his ideas of a person that can use it. It's, so the next, the next period that uh, it's, uh, let us talk frankly. So. To use uh, this is uh, according of the method that uh, a person can like it to use it. So when we say that justice, as I said to you, that it has many uh, it has many definitions. Uh, so you can use it. You can able that to use this uh, meaning uh, according of the the, the, the method that which you use. So uh, there is, uh, as I said, that there is a uh, many periods that can let us that to use the rest. Uh, 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 according of the law, so for example, that when you can, uh, when you, you let a person that can use uh, justice in 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 in, 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 in the same way that he can use it, so we can go to, to call it justice. Uh, I don't want to prolong my suit. Just uh, I want to stop here to give a chance for uh, uh, other person can use it. Thank you a lot. Thanks. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you a lot. The timing is all open. Uh, the, my brother said there's a lot of concepts of justice. You can you can mention, for example, like uh, social justice, which you concern economically and politically, and even uh, what so called. There is uh, different types of um, concepts. So, how welcome the door is open. Uh, welcome, welcome. Yeah, take your chance. Your name, this man. Give him a hard club. Assalamu alaikum. I do thank the Sudanese Research Foundation. I am not a master in English language, but I want to try. So, but I want to try. So, in my humble uh, opinion, justice is means uh, apply the law between people, apply the same law between people. That means justice is uh, taken, taken by what? Taken by uh, law. For example, if you have uh, two kites, one of them in uh, Paris school and another in uh, a secondary school, you have to give in preschool uh, like uh, five pound and in secondary school ten pound. That means this is the justice. It's, if you say justice is equality, you have to give both of them ten or or uh, five. Thank you. Thank you so much. As simple as it is, a clear example, you have two kids, one of them in the primary school and the other in the secondary school, okay, they have different aids. If you say justice is equality, you give them either five or ten pounds, okay. If you are applying justice, so you give one of them, for example, if you give the, the young one five, you, you should give the other one more than five, so that's it. Last. Uh, chance or the last two chances okay a minute one two three four five only minute for everyone six okay 
We have okay, five is, minutes. We have one minute. Okay? Yeah. Welcome. One minute. Try to be short. Get the time. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, I'm Amar Abdul Shafi. And uh, firstly, uh, I'm so grateful to the Anisri Research Foundation for the collect us here for sharing our ideas. Uh, I just have a little point to want to edit. Uh, yes, uh, in addition of uh, definitions that are given. So, it's like uh, uh, the justice is like uh, morally conceptions stand on uh, religion and uh, rationality and uh, the law. And uh, it's like uh, just uh, it's more different between law and justice, which is the justice is something have been written, have been sent from from the God to let us like sit uh, and live together to take our rights when we are oppressed. And the law, something happened like uh, children or written by uh, human. So, and sometimes even the law is like uh, it's not suit with all people. That's why they somehow uh, the law is weaker than justice. And uh, there's like a difference in justice. It depends on other society. So, like, uh, and what makes a difference? Uh, like uh, the applying of the justice. It, it like uh, dif make it different in society the, the, from from society to the society. And the other thing is, uh, the other thing is, the, cons the, the way of uh, of the people, how they are conceptualized, this uh, justice. And uh, I guess that's all, and uh, thank you. Thanks. Thank you a lot. Yeah, chance. Um, be quick. One minute. Okay. Uh, uh, if you'd like to speak about, for example, transitional uh, justice, okay? So what do you see the justice in the next period, the transitional period? Uh, it's okay, uh, Muhammad Yagub, and I'm so glad to be here and to talk about this issue. But, you know, let me just firstly define the justice according to my humble perspective. Uh, justice, it means to treat everybody in the country according to his effort and according to his right. And equality, it means the constitution of the country should treat all the citizens fairly and together as one citizen. So that's all. But about you know how, uh, the, the problem or the justice that should be applied at this period, unfortunately, let me say that candidately, in Africa here, we have all the laws, except the law that says we have, uh, we have applied the law. So that means corruption and this is this is the thing that makes us make a revolution and bring this regime down but i'm so optimistic about the the second period and it, it is going to be a something you know um like uh, better for this country and i hope to do so and we hope to get our rights from those two shit people thank you thank you so much yeah what of you welcome Assalamu alaikum. Today of Allah, the most merciful, the most compassionate. Uh, I do thank all of you. I'm very enthusiastic to be here and talk about uh, such amazing topic, uh, which is justice. So I have been uh, wondering since morning about justice because I don't believe something called justice. This from my own perspective. You know why? Uh, because the justice is this type of just excuse and make you weak. For uh, most of the people, they have said that justice it, uh, means to have your right, to have uh, freedom, to have all those stuff. I do agree 110% with them. But you have to just, instead of the uh, freedom or right, you have to begin by yourself because there is no, do not consider yourself like an uh, object or like victim because the life itself it is not just or unfair, unfair. The life itself is unfair. But if you are going to wait until you get your rights or until you get the just in this life, the life is itself is unjust, by the way. This from my own perspective. The, the matter of the right or freedom. So you have to just to, to make good relationship between you and yourself. 
You have to develop yourself. You have to begin by yourself. You have to just upgrade yourself in order to to be the, the like the person you cannot imagine it. This is the reason you are not where you want to be. So if you are or if you reach this level of self pursuit of happiness or self control, you are going to know there is no person will just stimulate you or you just promote you as well as there is no person will promote you because there any person just focus in his own life just there is no something called justice this from my own perspective and instead of uh, also right the right it's taken by the because you have to fight uh, of your life, of your right, until you gain your right. And I do believe that when we are going to talk about the justice, it takes more than speech. It takes conversation, as you may know. It takes constellation of, of uh, conversation. It takes more than time. But this is from my own perspective, and I do thanks all of you to give me this chance. Thanks. Okay. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm gonna ask you a question. Uh, come over here. Um, for the people who committed crime, like Omar Bashir, okay, uh, do you like punish them or just let them go free? Uh, yes or no? Which one? Very good point. Uh, yes, of course. They they have to be arrested. They have to they have to be punished. Punished. Yes. That means you believe in justice. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah. it. That's it. No, 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 okay. No, no, thank no. you. Thanks. Thank you. Okay. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you for giving me this chance. And uh, I would like to say, uh, justice is uh, given, not taken, by the way. Because, uh, because we put law in our country. If there is uh, no justice, we will, uh, if, if there is justice without giving, we will never find uh, uh, a law in, in, in the country. Okay, this is the, the first thing. The second thing. You, you, the last speaker mentioned something. It's good, by the way. Uh, he, uh, he has said the life is unfair. Actually, if uh, if someone he st steal your uh, stole his your phone, for example, what will you do? You will fight him if you are strong, okay? But if you are weak, what will you do in this case? You will go to the law, right? For giving you your right. We are not animal we are not living in the forest to take our right by violence by hurting each other and th that's my point thank you so here laws represent two chances the last two chances because of time just yeah yeah um i'm going to just summarize um of course it's obvious in very paralyzed community, justice cannot implement it. Let us to be realistic what my friend is saying that. If, but intellectuals, community, this justice should be implemented, of course. You mentioned Africa. One of you mentioned Africa. Africa is up bringing, up growing with dictators, if they don't believe in justice. And this justice, by the way, start from your family point of view within your family are they justify you with your own friends your colleagues your brother your sisters if you are bring with this within your family you know how to implement out but if you have been dictated family you are no longer going to bring with justice and you don't believe in justice thank you thank you that's it the last chance Yes, uh, thank you so much. Thank you for giving me this uh, chance. Uh, the definition of chance, according to the one, my mind, is uh, work according to the law. Work according to the law. The kind of justice is uh, political justice and economic justice and social justice and judiciary justice. The very, which is very important in our society. Or what we need in our society, we need the political uh, justice and uh, political. Justice. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thank you so much because uh, 
We have spoken today about the transitional justice. So I have here a definition. Transitional justice consists of judicial and non-judicial measures implemented in order to redress legacies of human rights abuses. Such measures include criminal prosecution, reparation programs, and various institutional reforms. And that means, for example, to do justice for those people who committed crimes. Okay? Because the the families of martyrs cannot be, I mean, satisfied unless we do justice for those criminals. So this how justice will be in the transitional period. Um, because time is over, we're going to say, as Abraham Lincoln once said, the world will need to know, no longer remember what we say here. But it can never forget what we did here, that this day shall not have died in vain, that this nation shall have a new birth of freedom, and the government of the people, by the people, for the people, shall not perish from the earth. Thank you so much. Good night. Tomorrow at the same time. Thank you.